Hallelujah to Jesus. Father, we bless your holy name. We give God all the glory. Let God be praised forever in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. This is God's own channel with Evangelist Sarah. You are welcome. The Lord bless you. The Lord bless every member of this household. It is well with you, child of God. Jesus love you. And I love you. Please, family, like this video, share, subscribe. Tell somebody about this ministry. God bless you. As we do that, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, amen. Hallelujah. Child of God, don't be shocked. <laughs> don't be shocked to see what is coming on. Hmm. A lot of people who never find you attractive, they are beginning to see you so attractive. And you yourself, you used to look at yourself, you are like, what is attractive about me? <laughs> What when you have a godly identity, everything about you become attractive. God does not need to look at your physical, your physical appearance before He can make you attractive to everyone. Hallelujah. You are like what you when you used to what is even so attractive. It's a lie. Oh. You have a godly inheritance, so you are attractive. There is something attractive about you. Don't be so shocked to see that people are starting to have interest in you. They want to know more about you. They want to learn from you. They want to ask you, how did you do it? Don't be shocked. Hallelujah. Yes, it is possible the enemy have covered your identity for so long. But your identity is being restored. When a thief is caught, it will be made to return sevenfold what they have stolen. If they have stolen their identity before, that is why people look at you as somebody that does not really have anything to his or her life when god restored the identity everybody will see you as somebody that has something to his or her life yes on our own we are nobody that is the truth on our own we are nothing but with god we are somebody with god we are something we cannot be with god and still remain a nobody because it is god that pick anyone that is a nobody and he makes somebody out of that nobody it is God that picked the one that is hopeless. I mean, and he make hope, hopefulness. Is it hopefulness? Out of that hopeless case. Hallelujah. You hear a song where well, sing, say, what will I have been if not for grace? I was lost, but now I am found. It is God that will take the one that is lost and that one will be found. A hopeless case. He will turn that case into something that is beautiful it is all by his grace and mercy hallelujah don't be shocked to see it when people start finding you attractive you are somebody in the lord so there is a divine identity that is upon you and that identity will be seen by all it is well with you jesus love you and I love you with the love of Christ. I remember your sister, Evangelist Sarah. By the grace of God, I will see you again. Bye-bye.